welcome students let us see a very interesting question from the topic probability this question has been taken from ncert book of standard 12 here question is a die is thrown three times two events are given here events e and f where event e is four aps in the third toss and f is six and five aps respectively on first two tosses then we have to determine probability of e condition to f okay so let us see the solution here first of all we'll need sample space what is the number of elements in sample space so since die is thrown three times you know a uh, die is having six spaces numbering 1 2 3 4 5 6 <laughs> and it has been thrown three times so total number of all the possible outcomes will be 6 into 6 into 6 216 okay so here number of elements in sample space this is 6 into 6 into 6 which is equal to 216 then event e four appears on the third toss okay so outcomes will be like this 114 then 214 144 144 144 Like this, up to up to six six four. Okay, so here total in E will be thirty six six into six. Here in E this is equal to thirty six. And what is event F? Event F is Six and five appears respectively on first two tosses. So here elements are six five one, six five two, six five three, six five four, six five five, and six five six. Total six element. So here N F this is equal to six. Now we have to find out probability of E condition to F. So we know the formula probability of E condition to F. This is equal to probability of E intersection F divided by probability of F. So we need to find out probability of E intersection F and probability of F. so let us see which elements are common means we need to find intersection that's why we need to see that which elements are common in these two sets okay so as we see here only this element 654 will be common since in this set third elements is always 4 so 654 will be common so therefore here e intersection f consists of only one element 6 5 and 4 so therefore n e intersection f is equal to 1 and uh, we can find out probability of e intersection f formula is probability number of elements in e intersection f divided by number of elements in sample space so e intersection f number is 1 and ms is 216 216 so here numerator is 1 by 216 now we have to find out pf also and f is having only six element okay so we know probability of f 
is equal to nf divided by ns and nf is 6 and ns is 216 so we can put the value of probability of f here 6 by 216 let us simplify it this will be equal to 1 by 6 so this is the answer fine very interesting very simple little bit tricky but we can do it very easily so students remain in touch with these videos and get maximum benefit of it and share these videos with your friends also and you have any doubt or want to give any suggestion please write in the comment box and you are really enjoying learning mathematics here as a fun your likes are most welcome thank you very much wish you all the best